Ooh, this is exciting. So I got my new camera. Hurrah, yay. Um, ooh, look at my other camera. That's funny, you can see me. I didn't think it was that, that type of angle. Um, so I got my new camera and um, so far I've been testing it through the week, uh, just getting it set up, see if this works. I think at the moment it's a bit too high for me to engage correctly, so I should probably put it here. I'm using my other webcam, which you can see here. Um, and I have this monitor. Can't really see it, but there's an extra monitor here. That's for the grade for the film. And so this monitor is uh, something I got from work a long time ago um, from a studio. And it's color collaborated and it's all fancy. Um, and it's just a temporary thing um, for the film. So once that's gone, I'll have more space for my camera and I think I'll probably put it there. Last week, we were working on these 2D animations and um, I managed to clean up a lot of them. Basically, I tried to clean up all of them apart from the one we're gonna work on today. So you can see what I did. So the cup one I redid, then um, I did a bit of ditto falling. So just made that um, the line's a bit cleaner. And then I also worked on Ditto's Yawn. So I didn't finish cleaning up, but I worked into it a bit more. I felt like it needed some more drawings. So I've been working on that, getting that a bit more interesting. And then this week, the plan is to give this, oops, nope, not that one. Give the same treatment to little Monty that we've been working on the last past, the last past? The last few weeks. I was also playing with setting up my soundboard this morning. It's a bit of fun. Don't know how the sounds will come through. At the moment, it seems like if I press any of them, they come through my mic, which doesn't make any sense to me, but maybe we can try some today. That would be fun. Um, yeah, it's welcome, welcome. Um, but yeah, on the road to 50 followers, which I'm excited about. So I put that little goal above and added an extra camera so you can see me move my hand. Oh look, it's pretty, it's not too bad in terms of like one-to-one. -one. I think it's a fair amount. Yeah, I think this is good to just get going on. We did think about adding a scarf, but I think I'm gonna leave that until the end. I do, I do wanna clean up what we've got. I think it's that way round. I'm gonna check because um, I mean, it's kind of one of those things that I left a bit loose in terms of like them being different sizes, but it would be nice. I think in, in the designs, I definitely kept it on one side. So if I bring up hmm, concept designs, Monty, see all my really old drawings. He was ginger at one point. We were going to have a a ginger tom cat. Um, let's see. So his right, yeah, you see I've done it different and some of them just working out what would be best. I'm pretty sure we went with his right eye or screen left eye, the bigger one. But yeah, look, the so, moths are crazy cool. Actually like fluffy. Did a lot of like going to um, museums and galleries, trying to find reference. I have a ton of different, uh, I know this is a butterfly, but a ton of different um, research trips, I guess, that we did. It's a lot of fun trying to get some of that in there. Because we started around, um, what are we, yeah, like 2011-ish. Uh, I started de designing the characters in 2009-ish when I was leaving university. 
and then we started um, putting together story stuff and then properly like full-on production I'd say 2015 but we've been yeah so it's been quite the undertaking and I thought I'd clean this up in front of you so you can see it. Um, it he probably, when I get to the top of his um, arc, will probably need to, I'll probably need to like move everything down a little bit, although he does get pretty close to the bottom of the screen. But I want him, I want to get all those antennas in and stuff, so I'm going to have to figure out how to do that. I'm, the other ones, I didn't change the aspect ratio, but I might with this one just... I think it will save a lot of time shifting stuff around. So now I'm just cleaning up these drawings. So the idea is that they'll look little like little pencil sketches, you know, they're not, um, again, it's not meant to be, if I turn off those other layers, it's not meant to be perfect. Um, but I want it to feel like white on black. So I'm just working on these now. Um, and in fact, I'm gonna turn these down further so I can, see the overall silhouette but that's my summary if you went here earlier well ooh. oh it's so sensitive i think i must have pressed a button here we go okay um yeah i'm pretty impressed with what we managed to oh i've really toned down the opacity i can't really see it i'm really impressed with what we came oh, up with oh you made a bummel duck a follower a follower i'm not caught up with the chat I'm gonna have to skip ahead and see. Crusty 3D, thank you so much for following. Yay, yay, two more to go. Thank you. Oh, did you hear the sound effect? Okay, great. Yes. Yay. I said I tested that too and I set it up separately so it should come through. Yes. Yes. Slowly getting there. My technical abilities. Good, here we go. Did that work? I hope so. I'll do it again. <laughs> it makes me so happy. I think she definitely have stickers for when the film is released. Yeah, I think that would be fun. I have, um, if I switch to my other camera, 
Oh, hello. Oh, wait. That's not my mouse. There's my mouse. <laughs> if I switch to my other camera, we had, um, they're all gone now, I think. I think we, do we have any left? I don't think so. We made some, oh, is it gonna? It should do. Yeah, we made these little pins, little badges. They're a bit old now. But we had a run of those um, for a, a conference we went to. They're really sweet. And we were giving those to the crew. These are the last few I have, so oh, this one's a bit dirty now. And give it a bit of a clean. <laughs> They're like matte, so it's actually cleaning. That's weird. I didn't think that would be possible. <clears throat> Walter dropped them all on the floor the other day. These ones that I had. There, there we go. Oh, oh, there we go. Um, yeah, that one's a bit dirty. But we had those made. So I was thinking I could do some of those and uh, my posters are in the hallway, I think. I don't have them in here. Yeah, so maybe some stuff like that would be nice. Um, I think definitely stickers, yeah. Teenager stories, please. Yes, please send stories. It's a process for sure, getting all everything set up. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I feel like it's a whole undertaking, so I definitely don't want to dig too deep into that until the film stuff is done um but yeah the embosser yeah i'm really excited about that um i can't remember the percentages below where we're up to on that but um uh i think that's gonna be add a nice touch to uh some of the prints like i want to print um some of my i did a test print at home for one of my photos um is it gonna focus it came out pretty nice we have um a canon the pro 100 i think so i'd like to do some stuff like that but i'm gonna talk to my friend about oh am i gonna be able to stick back up on the wall <laughs> i'm gonna talk to my friend about what would be the best way i dropped it uh i'll put it back up in a bit um what would be the best way to go about that like um i feel like printing at home is not um doesn't make sense money wise but it makes sense in terms of being able to invest them and stuff and all that but then posting packaging and all that stuff yeah so definitely uh something to look at in the future once the website is not just a splash screen Prince to be glad. Oh, yeah. I read how to pronounce this word and I've forgotten. Mm. Is it glee? Grease? Oh, no. I even looked it up. Oh, you made it up. Yay. Thank you so much, Coonsby. You've made it 50. Yay. Woohoo. I can use my soundboard right now. Where is it? Wait, wait, wait. Yay! Oh, there's a phrase. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> fifty. Woohoo! Hundred percent. Boo 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 boo. Yay! I'm so excited. I'm gonna swatch. Uh, swatch. I'm gonna switch back to my drawings that I was working on uh, trying to clean up these uh, thank you so much for 50 ah means I can go on to the next thing for my affiliateness and get those emotes going so we're cleaning up these we've got about where are we we're like here somewhere sort of halfway probably need to do another run on the anten antennas antenna antennas and it's 20 to 12, so it's not too bad. Got like an hour and 20 minutes. I think I can get the rest done. I said I wouldn't do the antenna at this point, but I am. But we can go back and do a pass. Don't, I'm not like massive fan of these frames, but I feel like they work in the motion for now. Again, I can always go back. Oh, I like this one's kind of fun. 
I also realized in my 2D version, Oh, and like you said, consistency, oh, 100%, that is one of my uh, go-to phrases. Actually, I think, no, no, I think one of my cards was that, right? <clears throat> I make these mixed cards. Re oh, only recently, just because uh, I have to wait for the computer to think about whatever it's doing. Consistency is, oh, will it focus? There we go, it's key. So I started making these, um, oh, if I move, hang on, let me just go back to my other camera. Let's see, there we go. So I started making these um, doodles while the computer is loading because my 3D software is, well, not just mine, but it's very slow. Um, and it came about because I started doodling on, um, is it going to focus on coffee cup? Oh, I can't. It's so hard to do it backwards. Um, and I really enjoyed doing that. And I want to... This was before COVID, <laughs> COVID, so I've had this couple while now. But I like the idea of going to a coffee shop and having a, a takeout coffee and just sitting there and doing this sort of thing. But for now, I've been doing the cards. But yeah, the consistency is key one. It is uh, such an important um, phrase in my, my world. There we go. All right. So I think the next step would be then to, I think just make, I think the best way is going to be to make the screen bigger. Let's do that then. Yeah, there's a room. Okay. I'm going to not worry about where he goes off screen for now. I can fix that if we need to. I see you're using a pen, so I'd still count that as hand-drawn. Yes, I do use a pen. It's true. Um, yeah, I can use that on my Cintiq, which you should be able to see on the other view. Um, so I actually didn't use it this week, which is naughty. But usually I would wear a glove, which often uh, some people have asked about, which helps me um, glide across the screen better. That would have been much easier. I totally forgot to wear it today. Um, it just helps because the screen's plastic and, you know, if you get hot, your skin uh, gets stuck to it. Um, but yeah, I really um, advocate for... I'm going to switch back to my chatty screen for a sec. Um, oh, I keep thinking the mouse is on the other screen. There we go. Um, I really advocate for the pen um, if you do a lot of digital or just even using the computer a lot. Um, I just find that the mouse... Uh, leads to, or at least this type of mouse for me, leads to um, carpal tunnel pain. 
pretty quickly and I found with the pen I get almost nothing um, unless I'm holding it really tight and <laughs> going a bit crazy um, so I would definitely uh, if you are using a computer a lot I would consider swapping if you can you don't have to buy the screen either uh, I have a uh, just a mat so it's the same thing it's just basically a, fan a big fancy trackpad I guess um, that's not a screen, it's just, just the trackpad. Um, because, yeah, I have the mouse uh, there just for um, well, just convenience, I guess. But I do, I do, f oh, and sometimes I guess the odd game. But yeah, even playing a game with a mouse, I f my wrist uh, gives in quite quickly. So, and wrist needs to last a long time. And seeing, um, uh, you know, like being around my nan and stuff and seeing the stuff she has to deal with at 94, I think. And how much hands can make a big difference. Uh, yeah. So anything, anything to save the wrists. Pen, pens is good. I'll see you all uh, next week. And thank you so much for popping by. Bye.